A dental abscess is a collection of pus that can form in the teeth or the gums as a result of a bacterial infection. How does this occur? Your tooth is made up of a hard white protective layer, the enamel, which covers and protects a softer yellow tissue called dentin. At the very centre of the tooth is the soft pulp, where blood vessels and nerves are found. Your tooth is attached to the jaw via a strong ligament, called the periodontal ligament. Bacteria are found in plaque, which is a byproduct of food and saliva. Plaque bacteria produce acid, which makes holes in the enamel that eventually reach the centre of the tooth. This is known as dental decay. The holes allow bacteria to invade the tooth and destroy the tooth pulp. White blood cells then pour into the affected area and pus forms, producing a periapical abscess, the most common type of dental abscess. A periapical abscess is treated with antibiotics and a permanent root filling is put in at a later date to prevent further infection. Sometimes an abscess occurs in the supporting tissues around the tooth. This is called a periodontal abscess. It is usually associated with gum disease, when the gums become inflamed and separate from the teeth, allowing bacteria to collect in pockets around the tooth root. Periodontal abscesses are treated with antibiotics and by cutting into the gum to drain the pus. Surgery is sometimes needed at a later date to reshape the gum. The tooth may also need to be extracted as a result of a dental abscess. If left untreated, the bacteria from the dental abscess can spread to other areas, including the nearby bone and the air-filled spaces behind the cheekbones. Infections that spread to the face, brain and neck can be life-threatening, but are rare. For more information, visit www.nhs.uk.